Hello, my name's Amy and I'm going to read you this brilliant story. This story is called Schnitzel von Krumm. Dogs never climb trees. And it's written by a brilliant person called Linley Dodd. I love this story and so do my three children called Grace, Gladness and Solomon. What are your names? My name is Amy. I can't wait to read this book. Let's start, shall we? Ooh. Oh, look. This shows me that this book is an ex-library book. I bet you know what a library is, don't you? A library is a fantastic place. Do you know why? Because it lends books to people. Books, 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 books. What are your favourite books? There are so many books about so many things. This book was a library book, but then it got sold. So someone like me could find it in a charity shop to buy. That's funny, isn't it? But I'm really glad because this is one of my favourites. Schnitzel von Krom. Dogs never climb trees. <laughs> Look, there he is. A dog to remember is Schnitzel von Krum, with his very short legs and his very low tum. He can bury a bone in a minute or two. There are many remarkable things he can do. I wonder what? Have you got a pet dog at home? He can hide in a woodpile of branches and twigs and he disappears into the holes that he digs. Look, can you see there? It's just his little bottom and tail sticking out of a hole that he just dug. He fetches the paper, the rug and his bowl. Sometimes his fetching gets out of control. Ooh, look at that funny little dog. He's got a pot in his mouth. He can hustle and tease with the greatest of ease. But everyone knows that dogs never climb trees. Hmm. He can gallop and scamper round bushes and bends. He has to run fast to keep up with his friends. Look, they're running off ahead of him. Go on, little doggy, run, run, run. He's got such small legs, he probably has to run twice as fast. What do you think? Have you got long legs or short legs or medium-sized legs? I think mine are medium-sized. He scatters the birds when they're taking a bath and splashes the water all over the path. He can hustle and tease with the greatest of ease, but everyone knows that dogs never climb trees. Uh-oh, look, who's he chasing? Mmm, watch out, pussy cat. He can ride on a skateboard. He teeters on top and flies through the air when it comes to a stop. His nose is so certain. His sniffer so sound. He can rustle a rabbit from deep in the ground. He can roll in the mud. He can wallow and play till he changes from brown to a globulous grey. Wow, look at him there. I bet it's fun to roll in a big, squishy, mushy pile of mud. I'd quite like that, would you? He can hustle and tease with the greatest of ease, but everyone knows that dogs never climb trees. Uh oh, look. Look where Puddy Cat's gone. Quick! Oh, hang on a minute. But if they are 
bold and adventurous too. It might just be possible. <gasps> Maybe. Dogs do. Look at Schnitzel von Crumb. He has climbed a tree. Wow, I love that story. And you know what? It's really brilliant. Because if you're really bold and adventurous, maybe you can do things that other people say you can't. You never know. It's really important to believe in yourself and be bold and adventurous like Schnitzel von Gramm.